here. I'm here to talk about the multi-format imager masking system. What this system is, is an overlay. Say you buy a permwall screen or an imager screen or a fixed screen from daylight. You have this fixed screen already on your wall. And what this thing does is this multi-format imager is it's like an overlay that goes over this frame but has these masking shades in the sides here. So you can take it on a screen you already have mounted, basically any screen, and put this imager screen in. And what it'll do will take 2.3, it starts at 2.35 to 1, and it'll mask all the way down to 4 by 3 or 16.9. Basically it comes out of the side and masks the sides to make any aspect ratio you want, whether it's 4, 3, 16, 9, I have another one called Letterbox, which is like 2.4 to 1. So you're basically taking, you have to start really with a 2.35 to 1 screen. So if you don't have that, you would have to buy another, the 2.35 to screen and the masking system together. And you got control options like remotes, uh, you've got switches you could do. You've got a multitude of controls that you can use to control these masking borders. And it makes it a kind of a cool setup for Somebody that wants the best setup in a home theater would get one of these. But it is a little not that budget friendly because it's quite expensive to have all these electronics put over another screen. The daylight imager masking says, hold on, I have CSR still up there. That doesn't mean anything, ignore that. But daylight imager masking system, excuse the handwriting. Uh, I used to be a lawyer, I think. No, I never was a lawyer, forget that. I just have bad handwriting, maybe I was a doctor. Doctors have bad handwriting, right? I don't. I just got bad handwriting. Professor HT Theater with the Imager Daylight Masking System. Imager is a fixed frame masking system that is available in both horizontal and vertical masking versions. Daylight's Pro Imager is standard with Pro Trim finish. Pro Trim is a fabric frame covering that aesthetically enhances the appearance of the installation while absorbing light that surrounds the viewing area. The Pro Imager can be paired with Daylight's Imager or DaySnap fixed frame projection screens that are available in either front or rear projection screen surfaces. Once the Pro Imager has been assembled, mount the supplied hanger bracket above your fixed frame screen using appropriate fasteners for your wall type. The distance from the top of the fixed frame screen to the top of the hanger bracket varies depending on the fixed frame screen model and can be found in the installation instructions. Using at least two people, hang the frame assembly onto the hanger brackets, making sure the lip on the back of the frame locks into the hanger bracket. Use the two small L brackets to hold the frame securely to the wall at the bottom. The standard installation of the Pro Imager is for a single 120 volt or 240 volt wall switch. Power will need to be routed to the wall switch and from the wall switch to the Pro Imager motor, located on the left end of the unit. Install the electrical connections in accordance with the requirements of the local building codes and the National Electric Code. A detailed wiring diagram is included in the installation instructions. Refer to additional instructions for optional accessories such as the external low voltage control, video projector interface, SCB100, or infrared and radio frequency remote controls. The Pro Imager is now ready for use and can be operated using the wall switch. Okay. 